$90? I know where that guy lives. That's like four blocks away. Just get it later. I can wait a second. God damn it! There's got to be an easier way to get one of these things. So. Why does the Xbox 360 suck more than the PS3? The only hard part about that question is, where do I start? Well, we can first start by talking about... This. It looks like an ordinary game, but it's actually... Screwed. I took godly care of this game, this was my first game for the 360, and within a few months of me getting it, it was completely destroyed. I took good care of it, I never left it in the system, and people are going to say, oh, it's my fault. No, it's not my fault. This game is cracked, it's scratched up, it just doesn't work anymore. Now the next thing I want to talk about with the Xbox 360 is the internet. Now, I'm not going to get into right away how you have to pay for it, I'll get into that later. Right now I want to talk about how it doesn't have built-in wireless, which I'm starting to notice how annoying that is, because I just switched from Optimum to Verizon, and when you get Verizon, they install a free wireless router. Now, I would be able to play live if the Xbox had wireless built into it. I'm not going to spend a lot of money on a cable that PlayStation 3 has built in. It's just not worth it. This is a wireless adapter for the Xbox 360. Now, for the PlayStation 3, you get a wireless adapter built in. These can cost anywhere from $50 to $80 when you buy them online, which is a really insane price to have to pay for something that's built into a different system that only costs a little bit more. But I've learned that Microsoft is always trying to screw you over, and this is no different. Now I'm going to briefly go over something that everyone probably already knows, but I think I should still go over it. And that's just the fact that you have to pay for the Xbox 360's internet. Which doesn't sound so bad, but it sucks a lot of money out of you over the years. It costs $20 to- Can I help you? No. Do I know you? Whatever. Well, it costs $20 for three months of being able to use the internet. Now, you can still download games and do stuff like that, but being able to play games online with other people costs money, and it's definitely much more worth it in the long run to buy a PlayStation 3. GET OUT OF MY ROOM! So, now we're getting to the last thing. The absolute worst thing about the Xbox 360. And what is that? That. Why it happens, I don't know. But one day, you could just walk into your room, looking forward to playing some Street Fighter, and that happens. If you don't have a warranty on this thing, Microsoft won't take it back. And I don't have a warranty on mine. So, I guess there's only one thing to do.
Anyway. You hear that? Wait, let me redo that. <laughs> okay, shh, shh, okay. Here we are! God damn it! There's gotta be an easier way to get one of these things. Maybe there is. <laughs> talk about the internet costing money. Now, actually, I should put that in a different video. Yeah. Don't you have any fucking shame?